Um, this was a mistake that I made. Um, <laughs> my, my original tweet, um, well, the, the, the fact is that Trinity College Cambridge has more Nobel Prizes than just about any other <coughs> institution you could think of. It has more Nobel Prizes. Trinity College Cambridge has more Nobel Prizes than any nation in the world except America, Britain, France, and Germany. Um, so that's a remarkable uh, result for one Cambridge college. Um, so it was extremely unfair of me to single out Islam to compare with Trinity College Cambridge. Um, uh, when I first wrote the tweet, I actually didn't use Trinity College Cambridge, I used Jews. Um, because if you actually look at the percentage of Jews, sorry, the percentage of Nobel Prize winners who have been Jews, it's astoundingly high. And it's something like between a fifth and a quarter of all Nobel Prize winners have been Jews. Uh, whereas the um, the number, the percentage of Jews in, in the world is something like less than 1%. So there's an enormous over-representation of Jews in uh, Nobel Prizes. And my original version of the, of the tweet compared the rate at which Jews get Nobel Prizes to the rate at which uh, Muslims get Nobel Prizes. And that, I think, would have been a valid comparison because they're both religions. Uh, they're not races and they're not Cambridge colleges, um, they, are, they are religions. And so it's at least worth asking the question, is there something about these two religions which predisposes to uh, success in scientific and other intellectual fields? And I do think that's a genuinely interesting question. Is it the case that some religions, some cultures, combinations of religions and other aspects of, of culture that actually uh, make it more likely that people brought up in those traditions uh, will be successful in scientific or other intellectual fields. And uh, it, could, I mean, it could very well be that something about um, Jewish culture <coughs> does predispose people to be successful in intellectual pursuits and something in Islamic culture uh, predisposes them the other way. My tweet did go on to say that uh, Islam in the Middle Ages uh, was extremely advanced and was um, well ahead of the Christian world, um, which is again something that perhaps needs explaining.